Hello, my lovelies, and welcome back to this very fetching shot of Barrett looking very, very, very angry at the wall for some reason. Yes, I can see that we're going to blast our way through there. I just want to have a look around. I just want to have a look around, see if there's any... No, there's nothing. It's just this. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, come on, Barrett. Blast your way through. Bit more vandalism. Why not? Yeah. Okay, brilliant. Um, before we do anything, let's heal up because we bloody need it. Cloud looks all right. He's he's sort of not part of the party at the moment, which is fine. God, Tifa's got a lot of hit points all, all of a sudden. That's nice. There we go. Excellent. Very nice indeed. Okay, so what's, what's going on? What's through here? If you remember last time, we encountered... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Were those... Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. That's the shinner I know. Yeah, no kidding, Cloud. Oh, he's having a little... Yes. Yes. <laughs> Bit of a flashback, eh, Cloud? Hmm. I knew that was going to happen. I knew it. Where are they going to sweep us to? What's going to happen? Oh, it's the cat again. Where the hell? Where'd the cat go? What the hell was that? Yeah, what was that? They didn't want us to see that, and they didn't want Cloud to remember. So what the hell? Ah, oh, there's Wedge. We need to get him somewhere safe. Everything else can wait until after. Agreed. Yeah, right. Let's go. No kidding. Everything can wait till after. Hmm. I hope he hasn't got any internal injuries, guys, because you're just making it worse. Hey! I love the cat models. They're, they are absolutely brilliant. Okay, so are we Cloud again? No, we're not. No, we are not. We are still uh, Barret. Ah, oh, look at the cat. That's so cool. Alright, let's get Wedge somewhere safe. Not that anywhere is particularly safe around here at present, I imagine. I want you to take Wedge back for me. I'm gonna look around for the others. Oh. He made it, didn't he? They could still be alive. I suppose they could. I mm, sincerely doubt it. I saw them both at the pillar. Yeah. Jesse and Biggs. Saw how bad they were hurt. Yeah, Biggs is definitely dead. I mean. I'm sorry, but... Don't. Oh. They've returned to the planet. Yeah. supposed to return to us. Mm. But it's a big change that Wedge survives, because the um in the original game he doesn't. They they all die when the pillar collapses. But if we stop now, they'll never let us live it down. <laughs> yeah, that's a good way of looking at it, Barrett. I like that. So we carry that weight. Mm-hmm. Barrett's lost a lot of people in his life, you know? Um, a lot of people. There's a, You won't see it in this game, but there is... In the original game, there's a whole backstory for Barrett. Um, it doesn't come until you get out of Midgar, like, into the main 
world um and it's really good he's got a great they've all got great backstories all of the characters do you get to see where they all come from um why they are where they are and who they are and it's one of the things that made final fantasy 7 just so good um because you really got to know all of the characters even the even the bad guy sephiroth we get to know where he comes from and why he is what he is is elmire gonna look after I'm wedge sorry. i truly am we had no other place to go, and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. Yeah, Elmari's a good one. Oh, that's so cool. That's, re that's really nice. I'm glad that one of them survived. It's sad that, Elmari, you know, Jesse. I know what Jesse. you said, but you have to let us go after Aerith. Not this again. Yeah. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people. And I know they're never going to let Aerith go. Yeah, it's true. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. Oh. We're all just numbers and meat Enough. to him. But... Are we going to meet Hojo? Ooh, Hojo is a bastard. <laughs> Please. I need some time to think. He's like, um... Your ultimate amoral scientist You've all archetype. Had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? That might not be a terrible idea, as it goes. Cloud, you cannot be comfortable sleeping like that. Oh, are we going to be Cloud again? If so, I'm going to have to swap some material out. God, I bet Barrett snores like hell. Like a rhino. What the friggin' frig, frig, frig? What's going on? That can't have been Aerith. That cannot have been Aerith. Okay, um, remove and remove, because we want to give that to Cloud now. Um, so... Bleh, where are we? Uh, we want the assess and the enemy skill materia. Because the enemy skill material is just friggin' awesome. Um, there we are. Um, fire, healing, elemental. That's good. So he's got fire element on his uh, on his sword. Um, hmm. What else can we do around here? Can we upgrade anything? Uh, not really. Cloud? Not really. He hasn't got enough. Um, I don't think so. Anyway... Or does he? Got all of these, haven't we? Meh, meh, meh. Not enough SP. No, oh well. Fair enough. We'll build some up. What the hell was that about? That was Aerith we saw going down there, wasn't it? Or a spectre thereof. What does it all mean? It's a very clever way they've made the game more than just a nostalgia trip. They've introduced some new mysteries to the whole thing. Oh, it is Aerith. Is this real? Or is this a dream sequence or something? Is she sort of visiting us from afar? Is she projecting herself somehow? She is an ancient. She can do shit like that. Hi. What are you doing here? How is this? Yeah, right? Oh, wow. Is What's the dream? Yeah. Maybe. You tell me. You okay? Don't I look it? I used to live in the Shinra building back when I was really little. Okay. Hmm. Your mom told us. Right. So it kind of feels like I've gone back to my childhood home. <laughs> I suppose. Honestly, it's not that bad. So what? You want to stay? Come on, Cloud. Don't be silly. And don't be an ass. Your mom's really worried too. Mm. <clears throat> too? So you're worried about me? Uh, of, of course. course I am. Yeah. 
<laughs> He's slowly, slowly softening up, I'm sorry isn't he? About that. Really. Look at that. That's beautiful, isn't it? Is that? Everyone dies eventually. It, what? Is this is our Aerith, or is it like an alternate version or something? So we need to make the most of the time we have. To live our lives the way we want to live. Every minute, every moment matters. I'll remember that. Good. Hmm. <laughs> So, <sighs> you need to embrace this moment, right? <laughs> I'm, I'm glad I met you, Cloud. Yeah. I really am. What's going I'm on? I'm grateful for all the words we've shared, for all the moments and the memories. You've made me more happy than you know. And I'll always cherish what you've given me. But... But whatever happens, you can't fall in love with me. <sighs> Even if you think you have, it's not real. Uh, this... Uh, I don't want to lie. Is that... Was that like a projection of her... I, I don't want to say too much. I don't want to spoil it, but... Time to go. <laughs> coming for you. Uh... If that's what you want. Thank you. If that was a brilliant encounter, if you know a lot about the lore of this game and what happens later. That was a fantastic encounter. Really well written. It's presaging a lot. That's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. You've done more for us than we deserve. Oh, Barrett's so I cool. Forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out however I can. Oh, that's, that's cute. Elmira. Ooh. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. Yeah, she is. So it's... please. She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I always knew it was coming. Yeah. Knew that one day... I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl, but not yet. Mm. Please, bring her back to me. <sighs> we'll do our best, you know? Daddy! Hey! <laughs> Marlene. Are you going? I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. Hmm. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Hmm? <laughs> Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? <sighs> and that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. <laughs> And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kind of... Odd. What? Sad. Nothing. Yeah. 
You should help her. There's definitely something going on you with will. this game's version of Aerith, and I don't know what it is. You'll come back, right? Of course, I promise. I love that making more of the relationship between Barrett and Marlene in this version as well. Okay, you can go. Oh, he has permission now. <clears throat> Excellent. Fabulous. Ah, the sunglasses are back. Me. <laughs> All right, time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. Yeah. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's some uh, material over there. Did Aerith leave that? Speaking of, uh, Barrett could do with a little bit of an upgrade in that regard. So what's he got? Um, cleansing materia, that's pretty good. That actually gets rid of, like, conditions. Revival, oh, that's good. I'm gonna, oh, yes, I'll put some revival on, actually. That is a decent bit of materia. Um, what else can we give him? Barrier binding, that's pretty good. Subversion, instant death, bloody hell. Breach and dispel, that's not bad either. Magnify, warding, uh, synergy. What else have we got? ATB boost. Uh, doubles ATB when activated. Cannot be used continuously. Eh, it's alright. It's nothing major. Hit points, magic points, magic up, l luck up, deadly dodge, first strike, auto cure, item master, provoke. Um, increases the effectiveness of items. Nah. Um, I'll put some poison on for him. I think that should be quite good, actually. We haven't used it much yet. It so can. How are we supposed to get topside? Yeah. With everything that's happened, the trains still aren't running. Right. Well, we could walk along the tracks. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit have probably been locked down by now. Pedometer so material. You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. Yeah. You mean Corneo? Oh fuck! We've got to go see Corneo again. Shit, pedometer material. What the hell does that do? I just want to know what it does. I've never. That's a new material. That's not in the original game. Um, deadly dodge. Refocus. Um, use the refocus limit break. Oh, Aerith has got that. Pedometer. Oh, okay. So it measures your steps. And it does stuff depending on how many steps you've taken. Alright. That's weird. Hmm. Oh, it's day now. It's all uh, all bright and reasonably lovely. So does, does that mean everyone's going to be back around now? Can we go and have a look at the different sectors, maybe, and talk to people? Hi. Sorry about that. I just ran into you, didn't I? Hello. Why? Yeah, everyone's still a little bit out of it by the looks of it. Um, oh dear, look at the state of her. Ah! That's not the original teacher, is it? Uh, Hi! No? No one's talking. I think we're, uh, we've just got to move. Uh, Chadley should be around here somewhere as well. I think Chadley's down as this way. Hi, guys. Right. There's the Costa del Sol thing. Oh, no, Chadley's not here. That's surprising. Let's just have a rest. Where is Chadley, then? Where's he buggered off to? We can't have got all the summons at this point, surely. Or maybe we do, because, um... Of course, there are loads in My the original... Grounders, oh, what the... Up, because, boy, do I have some news for you! What the hell? And it's assured to knock your socks Oh, all what's the going way on? After bombing Wait. reactors one and five, what do the eco terrorists do? They go for the trifecta and take out Mako reactor seven. Another attack by amateurs who don't care about collateral damage. The sky is falling and Avalanche is to blame. Uh -oh. but wait! Did you know Wu Tai is the one funding their activities? For all their claims about fighting for the slums. They're nothing more than pawns of Wu Tai. 
puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. Uh oh. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. Oh. Five gil. Five gil. Come on. They've got Damn. agitators Damn. and talking heads. It's the reactors. They want them. We got them. Does this mean there will be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gil apiece. Cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> Way yeah. the damn pawns of Wu-Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit? <laughs> <sighs> no one will listen to us. No, they won't. There's no point in even trying. That's kind of true. Just let them get on with it. Let them get on with it. I love I'm Tifa's sorry. new gloves. They're great. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for regrets or what ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. Mm -hmm. I know. But right now, instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Yeah. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you, don't. Yeah, it's not worth it. We'll end up fighting the people we're trying to save, you know? Okay, odd jobs, the final job. The collapse of the plate means that many people in the slums are in desperate need of assistance. Once the party enters the Shinra building, they will no longer be able to help anyone in need. Therefore, try to help as many people as possible before entering the Shinra I HQ. Okay, so... Presumably, we can do a few jobs around about, yeah? Really fall? What, where have you been? Of course it really fell. Mithra Rod, Arcane Scepter. Have we got one of them? Yeah, I've got one of them. Um, okay. The world's just too dangerous these days not to keep a weapon at your side. Yeah, I've got plenty. Don't worry about it. Um, <laughs> shit. Okay. So, can we get jobs from, like, here, like last time? Oh, no, not yet. So, where do we go? Who needs help? Presumably everyone at this point. Hi! Hmm. What about the kids at the school? Do they need help? No? Ah, good quest. Uh, what am I gonna do now? Hey, I don't know. What I do you want? You. You're Eret's bodyguard. Yeah, you that's really me. Use her help. She always knew where to find the best herbs, and you haven't seen her, have you? Mm, I used up all my meds treating scene. people injured when the plate fell. You see, I could make more, but not without those herbs. Okay. So what do you need? You mean you're willing to help me out? Sure. Oh, thank you. You'd be doing this town a huge favor. Okay, cool. Here's a list of everything I'm looking for. Doctor's list obtained. Yay! Okay. So... We've got a quest! Excellent. And we'll do that one. Uh, town doctor has asked Cloud to gather components for his meds and collect three items on his list. For details about where to find them, talk to the doctor. Okay, cool. So... Please, hurry. Time is of the essence. Sure, but where do I get them? My patients were talking about a behemoth in some underground lab or something. Can't what? Say I've ever heard of a lab like that before, though. A behemoth? Oh shit! That's what the roaring was. It wasn't. Oh, the behemoth is a classic Final Fantasy monster. It's a, it's a beast. It's a real nasty piece of work. It's uh, oh god. Is there a behemoth in this game? If so, that's that's kind of bad. Ah, so we've just got to, like, find the herbs as and how and where, presumably. A behemoth in an underground lab? Hmm, oh, hello. Was that another quest I saw then? Hmm. Okay. Oh, there's another one here. Cool. And another one there as well. Cool. Hi. 
them. Oh, it's Miss Folia, yay! Have you seen the kids around by any chance? Sort of. I haven't seen them since they left to do their patrols. I knew I should have told them to stay inside today. Probably. If you do happen to run into them somewhere, could you tell them to come back right away? I can describe them if it'd help. Sure. Don't worry. I'll know. <laughs> Just stay calm and wait here. You never know. They might come back on their own. Okay? Uh, yes. Of course. Thank you so very much. <laughs> She's a bit, a bit intimidated by Barrett. It's uh, it's easily done, isn't it? It's easily done. Oh, there's quests to do in here as well. Okay. Well, let's talk to the kids. Why not? You know, the more quests we can get, the better. Oh, we can we can sell our Moogle medals as well. Yay! Golden saucer theme tune. I love that. Love it to bits. Hey guys. Hello you, you very strange child. Not your costume, that's for damn sure. Um, steel pincers. Okay. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, that's, um, that's interesting. Enfeeblement ring. Okay. That's strange. Ah. Moogle's mortar. A medicinal mortar that Moggy sometimes has in stock. What is that for? Telluric scriptures. I'll have one of them. Yeah, increases Aerith skill points. Cool. I'll have that because I don't know what it does. Um, I suppose we may as well get the steel pincers while we're here. Um, that'll do, I think. Uh, yeah. Cheers. Have a merry Moogle day. Oh, I'm sure I will. Hi kids. What's yeah, the uh do it. Oh, Come hi. On. Oh, hey Cloud. You're just in time. Just in time for what? what? We made Wackabox way harder. Yay. It's not just a little kids game anymore. Oh, joyous. It's practice for the real deal. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will, you know? Joy. Whacking boxes wasn't training us for anything. So we decided to whack monsters instead. Yay! Wow. That sounds like a terrible idea. <laughs> it is not. We've all put up much better scores than you since we started. It's probably true. So why don't you try beating us before you talk? Yeah, Cloud. Put your money where your mouth is. Um, oh, let's just go for hard mode. Why not? Um, a Crescent Moon Charm, a Transference Module, or a Moogle Medal. And you get an Elixir. A Transference Module. Yeah, sure. Why not? I'm probably going to suck at this, but pff, why not? Let's go for it. No holding back. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. There we go, that's cool. Cool. It is way harder. <laughs> yeah, they were right. Get ready. Okay, cool. Okay, that's not too bad. We did all right. Didn't do brilliantly, we did all right. Oh dear, are the kids not happy that we did reasonably okay? We're not quitting already. Why? I got an elixir and a Moogle medal. Yay, I suppose. I am quitting already. Okay, so let's go see what else we can do. Love that music. Love it. It's so nostalgic. It's unbelievable. Hey. Okay, right. Let's go see if we can find more of the kids, shall we? Where are, what are we doing? 
Oh, what am I doing, actually? Um, so there's a secret medicine and the missing children. I suppose we can do the missing children for now. Let's put that one on. And does that give us any clues on the map as to where we need to go? Doesn't. None of these do. So we've just got to find them, I suppose. Wander around till we find them. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it's is that? Hey, you, Cloud, right? You're just one of yeah, Sam's guys. Sam, he told me who you are. Said you're a merc and a former soldier at that. Yeah. Listen, I hate to ask, but we got a few runaway birds. Okay. Mind helping us find them? I've got to find things, chocobos. So startled by that plate coming down. Ah. Just up and bolted. Okay, fair I'm enough. Sure they're around here somewhere, frightened and hungry. <sighs> My poor birds. Worried about them, huh? All right. I think we can help you out. Oh, Barry, oh, you're softy. Thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told. And their names okay. are Coco, Lolo, and Momo. Okay, They'll fair enough. Home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I'm counting on y'all. Okay, Cokes. Um, chocobo carriages will take you to destinations much faster than by foot. Finding the missing chocobos for Sam increases the number of available destinations. To take a ride, check the schedule at a chocobo station or talk to the staff. Okay. Right, okay. So, there are different chocobos all over the place. Okay. Sector 5. Right, okay. That's really cool. Okay, that's fun. There are lots of jobs. There are lots of jobs to do, my loves, which is all to the good. All to hey, Chadley, what are you doing? Got anything else going on? To help me gather vital information for my research. Fair enough. What have you got? Anything? Nothing. VR missions? No, we've done those. Okay. Anything else going on? Battle Intel submissions. Fair enough, Shadows, I suppose. What else do people have going on? Okay. So we've got that, we've got that. Is there anything else going on? Petal Lane! That's called Petal Lane. I like that. That's cute. That is kind of cute. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I'm just looking for markers, really. See if there's anything, any other um, things we can do, you know? Any other jobs and things. What about in the old folks' home? Have they got anything that we can do? No? No? Alright, fair enough. Everyone's good at heart, but sometimes Whatever you say. I'm not sure I believe that. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, maybe worth going into the battle area as well. I mean, the kids may be there, which would be bad, wouldn't it? Not gonna make it into work anytime soon, so might as well play. Right. Okay. Oh, there's the Chocobo station. That's cool. Oh, a lot of the refugees are here. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, I'll bet. There's the station. Okay. This is one of the, uh, the exits, isn't it? This is to one of the combat areas. Oh, no, this is the, um... Oh, yeah, more refugees. This is the area where we first um, arrived at Sector 5 with Aerith. I wonder if there's anything down here. It looks like, I mean, barring the jobs, I think we're near the end game now. Ah, hello. What's going on here? Hi. More refugees. God, they're everywhere, aren't they? Everywhere. It's kind of sad. Hi. <laughs> so I suppose we've got the run of the city now. We can go around and find different things. 
Uh, and we can do any, like, secret areas or anything like that or whatever, which is kind of cool, isn't it? What the hell is this? Oh, that's just creepy. I'm not going in there. Oh. Hi. You're odd. You wouldn't believe the records I found when I was cleaning out my closet. All right. Want to take one off my hands? Sure. Turks theme obtained. That's my cool. My husband, he loved music. Okay. Cool. Cheers, I suppose. Thank you very much. Uh, there's that big Warhammer 40,000 robot thing. God, look at this. Is that the way we came in? Might be. Yeah, so I think now, before we go to the Shinra building, we've got the run of the city and we can just do all the, um, all the little, uh, tasks and things. So that's, that's cool. We are right near the end. It's just a case of, um, doing the jobs, building up our characters, then heading for the Shinra building, I think. Okay, what the... What is this? This is kind of cool. Do we really have to deal with Corneo again? I suppose yeah, no we do. Choice. Yeah. Hey, up. Did you guys get into it with them or something? You. I bet. Be... <laughs> hey, Cloud. What happened? Don't recall. <laughs> I bet Cloud doesn't want to talk about it either. Um, okay, my loves, when we come back, we will see what odd jobs there are to do around here. Until then, my loves, bye-bye.